getting a budget in place and following it hard. We're at Valley High School and we just seen a presentation about basically credit scams and how to maintain your debts and all that. We presented for CARE, which stands for Credit Abuse Resistance Education, and this is the 10th year that CARE has been going out to all the high schools to talk to the students about preparing for the future and managing their credit. If you have maxed out all your credit cards, you're going to have a lower credit score. Than Financial planning and realizing how decisions that you make today affect your future is so important. And I believe that the earlier that we can teach kids about how to manage their money and how to um, handle credit and credit cards and student loans, it, it sets them on the right path. As lawyers, all of us have seen in the very unfortunate consequences of bad credit decisions and how that can really effectively ruin a person's life in some ways and sending them into bankruptcy court causing divorce, causing the repossession of automobiles, the loss of their houses. They're out there in the real world, and I'm a senior going to college, and I'm ready to be out there in the real world too, so it's good to get somebody else's point of view on a, on a certain type of objective. We don't have experience in it, and we need someone to tell us what's gonna happen and how you need to deal with it. Because it also affects your credit score. Even if they're not going out and you know, creating their savings account today. Um, it's something that we've given them a little bit of information and they're now aware of when they do go out to get that credit card, the things that they need to be looking out for and the things that they need to be thinking about so that they're well informed and making right choices. I got a debit card. I don't plan on using credit at all in my life. And yeah, I'm not trying to use it, no loans or anything. I'm going to college for a scholarship. Everyone has to have credit. And it's good to have better credit than not have good credit at all. And trying to get yourself out of that. It's a lot harder than just keeping your credit up.